So you see, hypo, hypo means under. Under, hypo means under less light. HP is infinite light, which is the light, which we will, which I've broken down and stated many, many times. Yeah. And that is why, you see, the language is reflecting back our divine nature to us. So hy hypo, hypo means under light. Yeah. Pyro, pyro means fire in the middle, which is light in the middle. But hypo means under less light. Yeah, which we which we will which we will see. Now I'm al I'm always going on about, always talking about. Yeah, I'll flip this uh, this 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 camera as well a little minute because and I don't like doing this because you, you can't see as you can't see as well probably. Now I'm always talking about these these ecstatic, blissful, orgasmic, abundantly infinite states of being. Yeah, now. I'm not going to be going so much into the plasma today and on this because I did that with the plasma school, but I will be in the next one, the energy compounding series too. Yeah. But, to, but I want to start this series by focusing in on the aged plasma, the urine and so on. So that's what I want to be fo be fo uh, focus this on. But this energy compounding that I speak about, yeah, is actioned by, by me using all of these, th all of these things. All of these things, yeah, by me using all of all of this, all in one set, go, yeah. So we we have been we have been we have been we have been put under serious serious um, mind control in terms of not understanding energy. Our energetic nature. Yeah. For example, some of the things that I have here, some of the things I have here, yeah, they can be used. Yeah. They, they, they can be used constantly. Constantly. Yeah. Not even, not even just like, oh, we can only use this a little bit or we can only use that a little bit. Yeah. All of the things here, yeah. All of them can be used more at higher levels than we think they are. And the reason is, is because we require voltage charge. Just like we think, oh, people require food and they require exercise and they require sleep. We require extreme voltage. That is the true key. That is the actual, tr the actual true um, the deciding, deciding key. So what, what's going to happen here is, is, is this. I'm at this moment, at this moment, right, the last, for the past, I don't know, for the past week and a half, I've been focusing on this dry, on this, the bow and arrow effect, dry fast. Now, that bow and arrow effect dry fast is usually, it's usually me going uh, in, a, in a dry state, I get my partner to do with me as well, like 18, 18 hours, 18 to 20 hours dry, yeah, and then that is the bow being brought all the way back. That is the bow, the bow coming all the way back. Yeah. Then, then that bow, that bow is then released. It is then released. Yeah. Via, via superior forms of energy. Superior forms of energy, superior forms of energy. Yeah allow us to then release that bow and arrow effect. Because so what's happening is the 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 the, the mitochondria and the fat burning process and the energy expenditure for in those areas has already taken place drastically. At five, six o'clock, at five o'clock you get another energy boost. We get an energy boost a blue light energy boost at around at around five. Yeah. So when you break it, if you break it around there, it's phenomenal. But this depends on how clear, how much of a clear state, how much of a clear raw state um, that we are that we are actually in. That is what it de um, de 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 determines it. Yeah, yeah, determines it. So it, like at this moment now, because I am not eating any, there's no all the all that's within me is just plasma light. It's just fruits, um, the plasma charge, the gases, matter state. And metaphysical state. At the moment, I've had nothing. So now, 
it's going to be coming up towards uh, 1 p.m. And then I'm going to break today at around 2 o'clock. Yeah. Once you get onto the third day, the day, day three, yeah, you wake up and you can feel like a, t- like, a, like, a, like a tingly, fuzzy, light, ecstatic buzzing running straight through your blood. And, and, and that is coupled with excitement within the emotional field. Now, that, is, that comes from the heart. That comes from the heart. Yeah, that's where that comes from. Yeah, at the minute I've got a gabbering, I've got um, gabbering in my mind because it was associated with something else which, which I've got in here. Yeah, so the, and the, the gabber, <laughs> these things are absolutely, are absolutely phenomenal for what they actually are able to do. It's like, for example, if you, like I've been saying, any sort of mental negativities you've got, if we can trigger the psychoactive nat- psychoactive elements within out within us through the blood brain barrier yeah you can expand your emotional field if you expand your emotional field you're now accessing emotions that reside outside of this physical plane which means that you are reaching a more immortal state of being so what i'm saying is 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 here is is, is this to break to break i'm going to go for the fresh urine yeah that's a morning urine, this. That's morning urine. Yeah. And look how light it is, right? And you know what happens if you say in your morning, you're sleeping, it's more acidic. This is why if you take molecular hydrogen before you sleep, see the hydrogen here? Yeah. If you take before you sleep, then what the hydrogen will do is it will reset and remove your inflammation while you are in, re- while you are in, re- in reset mode. So that when you wake up, you are already in a more balanced, perfected state. Because it's triggered the anti the natural natural pathways for antioxidants, etc. This is only in the matter state. This is only in the matter state. This is this is the plasma in the metaphysical state. Different, totally different, different levels. So that what happens is I'm gonna drink that, but since well, as my energy is increased, I need less. So I'm not gonna drink nowhere near all of that. I'm only gonna come to about here. I need less in this in this state. Anything that I put on my skin. Anything that I put on my skin, yeah, is, I'm, I'm going to feed off it. It's, it's, I'm, it's, it's going to start. I'm going to start feeding off it straight away, yeah. Through which we're going to. I'm going to speak about the, the, the skin and the gases and so on and so forth going forward, especially and the plasma school presentations, right? Because there's some phenomenal things that that, that that can be done with the gases that are emitted from your skin, yeah. Vice incoming and ex, vice versa, external and internal, going out and coming in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break. With that to about here, yeah. What I, what I'm what I'm then going to do, what I'm then going to do is I'm going to take this canister here, yeah. This is my tried and test, testy canister. That's what it looks like. This it is clear, really but it's got all this. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to use this this auric gold here, this auric gold. Now, the what happened with this this substance here is it grew, it grew in its magnetism, yeah, because when I excreted it, when I excreted it, when I left it outside in the physical, we, we, you are only working on the matter state. You're not realising that there are many other planes that coexist, but that you can't see them. So even though this is in a bottle, it's still alive. It still has a life. It still has a life. It has a field. And what it, so what's, what happens with its field is it ex, expands its field and then it grows. It grows yeah, in its energy, and it grows in its consciousness, yeah, so all the elements that are within it, they, they become magnified at the same time as well, and it's because I am using my own waters, so because of that, our mother and father then, they then reward, reward us, because now you are, you are using your, your waters, which is for, and your urine, which is for, and she is, she is matter, yeah, so through that, that is what is, is, is taking place. Now, I was going to wait, yeah, but I won't now. I was going to just, just say this on a different presentation because I'm always going on about the, uh, the, the, the numbers. I use syncretism and I'm always talking about letter and number, right? Now, I'm going to use this uh, occult, um, almost even Masonic, um, Deep, deep, deep in the standing to give you a clear insight of why of why this is so important. Because you are approaching 2020 now, 
and you need to we need to realize that that two two is her waters and that's why they keep releasing films on the 22nd um and so on and so forth and you'll see everything to do with the fours and the 13s yeah and everything else so i just want to just 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 pull up this right okay right so here in the tarot see this here this here is the 22nd card the world right 2020, 2022, yeah, Matrix is four. I'm going to go through, I'm going to be going through all this. I'm going to mention this on this one, and when I do the next one, I'm going to go into it even deeper. But I just want you to see. See, if you go by, I go by symbols, this is louder than word. So you see, she's here, but she's, represents, she's here, but she also has four. There's four here, look, you see, you've got, what's that, a lion, the bull, see, the bull, which is the Taurus bull, yeah, and then there's the eagle, the cherub, the lion. See, the, the lion is your is your passion. I'm going to do a post on that. Sometimes I find in the inorganic matrix, people, they think, ah, oh, they find, they might find me to be my passion. When you're passionate, they think that you're something wrong with you. You're passionate. Oh, why are you so passionate? You're aggressive. No, it's just true care. It's true real care. So I, this is the last card. You see, the, the Hebrew alphabet, the Hebrew alphabet, which is the language that Adam and Eve spoke, is only 22 um, letters. 22. 22 yeah so and we're going to go into this much deeper on the next presentation but i just want to read this right the world a nude female figure holding the one in her in her hand is placed in the center of an ellipsis her legs crossed like those of the hanged man at the four angles of the card or picture we find the four animals of the apocalypse and the four forms of the thing of the stinks the man the lion the bull yeah and the and the and the eagle yeah this symbol represents the macrocosm and the microcosm. That is to say, God and creator, or the law of the absolute. The four figures placed at the four corners represent the four letters of the sacred name. Right? Four letters of the sacred name. Or the four great symbols of the tarot. Namely, the scepter, the cup, the sword and the pentacle. Between... The sacred word that signifies God. In the centre of the figure is a circle or ellipsis representing nature and her regular and fatal course. From this comes the name of rota, rota, rota wheel. Remember I spoke on my last one, I was teaching, I was teaching about the R roll, the power of the R roll. The R roll, you could bring the gods down into your presence. Yep. In, in order to, so that you can become a creator, you can start to master your reality. So it's not as easy. I can say it, just say that, but it's not just as easy as that. But, but that is what is happening. And that R roll, you'll find it in that Maha Mantra. Maha Mantra is MM, which is 44, right? Which is will. And the Maha Mantra must be done 108 times, which 108 is 9. Yeah, right. Boom, which is connected again to, to certain cyclical patterns that six, six cyclical cycles, cycles that take place. Right. Right, rotor wheel, given to it by the Gulamin Postal. Lastly, the centre of the figure represents humanity. That one I was speaking about, it's connected to Uranus, and Uranus, that was just what I was saying, that cyclical, uh, cyclical movement connected to Uranus, and Uranus um, represents change. Yeah, and it's also it's it's color coding is checkers, white and black checkers, yeah. Which is which is white and black, masculine and feminine, and it's also your 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 ignorance versus your enlightenment, right? So lastly, the centre of the figure representing humanity. This letter therefore contains itself in a re re recapulate recapulation of all previous ones. Right. So there, there that I was just reading here, yeah, the 22, this 22 here, yeah, represents the world and the nude female finger, uh, the, fe uh, the nude female holding the wand in her hand is placed in the sense of ellipse, her legs crossed like those of the hangman at the four angles of the card or pictures we find the four animals of the apocalypse which is your four corners which is your four elements also yeah which is the four elements 
Now, we have to raise, that, raise up internally through, the, through that four elemental state. Now, right, and that is done via energy. Now, look at this four. See this here? This is one, two, three, four oxygen. And guess what? Surrounded <laughs> in the center is the light, is the light, which is the P for light. Which is seven, that P7, yeah, is the phosphorus. Yeah. That P7, that P7, which we can see there, yeah, as the, um, as the phosphorus, yeah, is surrounded by these four. And these four areas, these four electric charged elements are the four oxygen that always are present. They're always going to be present when you are working with, now we've missed some of this, right? When you are anything to do with white phosphorus, anything to do with white phosphorus is in alignment with oxygen. Yeah, massive. Anything to, anything to do with that. Right, I'm going to go, go into that because I just wanted to, to, to say this. So what's actually happening is this here, this stuff here, yeah, contains pure phosphates. Phosphates are a direct energy charge, the ATP energy currency. Currency is what you require to accelerate life in this place. For you to expand, extend, leave this place, go back to your true home, do any, accelerate, yeah? Expand in what you are. Reach immortality, everything is all based around energy currency. If you want to leave this realm to go to higher realms, you have to have the correct currency. I stated that long, 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 long time ago, and that is the way, the way that things, the way that things work. So we're going to continue to just go in, go in, go into those boards. But before that, I want to just, I want to speak about this, um, this energy compounding here. Yeah. So once, once that has been drunk, now all of this is happening. Remember, when we are in a totally clear state, you have to be in a totally clear state for your your to speak to your true body speak to your true body it was it won't recognize because it is trying to constantly create equilibrium always constantly brahatin yep that's how it, how it works so once i break with with this this fresh this fresh stuff here it's not that it's not nowhere near as it uh, has the higher levels of energy but it's a great breaking point because it still contains all of the aminos and everything else on a lower level, so that my body then downloads that, but it's downloading it, but at breakfast, yeah, as a breakfast application, which we're going to go in, which we're going to go into on this other board, right? Before, in actual fact, right? Before I've done any of that, now I used to use that, but yeah, I've done because we're talking about the urine. You see, before I do that, I'm doing now. Some people now this is. What I've always known and learned, this is what I've been teaching myself and what I've learned. Now, this is why I now teach it to people, right? I'm not going to go too much into this, into this, right? This no, out of this world, otherworldly, yeah, phenomena, right? I'm telling you now, I'm not going to, not going to, but some people would say to you, oh, you need to drink 50 ml of this, ml of this, and then another 50 ml of it later on, and 50 ml. Not me, no. I'm going to drink 400 ml. Of this, now. I've worked up to that. I'm going to drink 400 ml of the of the CO2, right? Now I'm going to go. And, we're going to go into all of that later on. But let me just tell you one thing: the the me this methane fuel here, methane is a fuel, right? Now that methane fuel, which can be used electrical electric generation as well, electrical generation, yeah, and the gas and so on and so forth. And it, and it can be used, which I'm going to be going into for some absolutely phenomenal things. Is connected with carbon and the same four again. See this four, our mother, she works in fours. She does not mess around or play around with all of this. Is all if you can grasp all of any what I'm saying to you here, you will re begin to regain, reclaim your divinity and recognize exactly what you are and where you are in this place. Yeah. So the methane, you see, it's all tetrahedral. Anything to do with energy. Has the geometry of a te of a, of of a, of a tetrahedral, a tetragram, and it also has the perfect incrementability. It has perfect incrementability. Yeah, the same as when we I was we speak about I was doing the um, 
the oxygen in a different presentation um a while a good while ago now a good while ago now we was doing the um the oxygens now i did i did i do have them do have them so if you if you like if you look at that one there you'll see here that it has again this here is phi right and this here is your that there is your is your is your father here this is spirit dropping down dropping dropping in yeah and then this is your your two hydrogens your two sixes and just this is your nine you see oh it's always there it's all there my continent neurology has allowed me to break open has allowed us to break open us because i'm giving it what anything i know i'm putting out for others to to know as well yeah because that's the moments that that we are in so to reclaim our divinity so oxygen is nine and that's why nine you see look how nine comes down and six goes up because you see nine comes down because he impreg in what he does is he drops down and impregnates the mother at the same time too so oxygen then interacts and produces and i and there's some things that we see i've seen some phenomenal things here with this stuff once it interacts with the oxygen yeah when, what that, that's the transmutations that take place but the geometry is perfection so this contains the, the perfection uh, the, it contains the, the 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 proportionality and the incommensibility of total complete perfection. Yep, because it really what it happens is it's it's the same as this. This is this Pythagorean pentagram here. Yeah, is that now the air and the water they are up above and the ether aligns with those. Why does it do that? Because you see, water doesn't just move in the matter state that we think it does. It also moves in the metaphysical, metaphysical, um, on the metaphysical planes. And it is, it is the main reason due to the metaphysical fields that you cannot see is the reason why you see the blue sky. In actual fact, you're surrounded by water. And so above is actual waters. So that's how, so I just wanted to explain it. And that's why you can see here, this is that nine again. See this cross here? This is him dropping down and impregnating these four elements with his ether because then what he, what he provides is this phi, yeah? He provides the inertia, this ether, yeah? And he, he is the, di the, 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 uh, the, the dielectric um, field, yeah? That, that triggers her magnetism, right? And that's why inertia is also four. Inertia was four, yeah? Which is our mother. Yeah, she's the plane, which is matter. And you see then homeostasis is eight, and eight is balance. And that's what we are getting here. And these two both symbolize, they symbolize water and fire. Water and fire. And that water and fire is water and fire. Water and fire. Water and fire. Happening within our blood. Yeah. So uh, I wanted to just to show that slide there to explain uh, what I was explaining on that on that part. So then I'm using to 400 ml of this, 400. This this the the the, the charge there. You cannot describe it by word, but we're going to go into that um, separately. Then 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 I'm going to drink. So perhaps maybe you know 250 of this, and then what I'll do then is is then save the rest. I've got all my other bottles down, all my other bottles down here. At the moment there's two. There's one little experiment I've got over there, which we're going to try and might conduct something with that in a minute now. Right. So we drink the, the, the 250 ml here on this one. And then once we've done that, once I've done that, I'm then going to move on to this uh, age plasma. Right. When I drink that age plasma, I'm going to put, I'll probably go for about two. What's that? If you can just see that there. It's wearing out now, this one. About 250 about 250 ml here. I've went through this, this, the, the other stuff, I've already had the charge implosion and I've already felt the superior forces running all the way through my vessel. Why is that? Because I've cleared out the state so the fields can now, can now communicate with just elemental charge, right? So then that, that has been drunk. So then what's happened now is, is, is I can then now look to start breathing now. Why can I then now look to start breathing? The reason, the reason that I can then now look to start breathing, yeah, is because what actually happens, 
I have some notes. I've got my notes and stuff, see? So if it goes a little bit bitty, it's because I'm looking at my notes at the same time as well. So what, what actually happens is, 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 is phosphorus is connected directly with the hemoglobin. Yeah? And because, because the phosphorus is directly connected with uh, our hemoglobin, yeah, which it is, what actually happens is it's connected directly with our breathing. Right. Now, a reason that you see you're always going to get externally to create, to generate white phosphorus, to, to, to raise its energetic state and turn it into a, fire, a white fireball, which is to turn it into a light body-ish white fireball, which is what we are. So this, we see, this is what it's shown us now. We know that, I'm going to show you now that you're a light body. Right. Um, yeah. In order for that to happen, oxygen has to take place. So that's what you can see here. That, this, what you're looking at here, is the phosphate ion. Phosphate ion is what we're looking at there. Right. Now, so what, what, what we're saying is, is, is this. Phosphorus is a major structural component of the bone, right, in the form of calcium phosphate, salts and so forth. Additionally, the phosphorus contains um, cert certain molecules, but it binds to the haemoglobin in the red blood cells, which then regulates oxygen delivery to the, to the tissues of the body. Right now, remember, I, I said that I don't li I, I charge. So if I'm having something um, and it's connected to um, organic natural life, due to the, uh, my understanding of it, I'm, I'm knowing, I'm knowing that I'm going to be able to take more of it. I'm going to be able to, to actually have um, a lot more of it. Yeah. So what what's going to happen? What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Yeah. What's going to happen is, is, is this, yeah. What's going to happen, what's going to happen, yeah, is, 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 is that, if, just pause me, just grab me that tester from there, please, the box of testers. What's going to happen, yeah, right, is, is, is that the phosphorus is always connected, is always connected to your, um, give me one second. So I'm going to run an experiment in a minute. I need to make sure I've got my testers to do it. Right. So the, phosphor, the phosphorus is always connected constantly to oxygen. Yeah. Always going to work that way. So what does that mean? It means that it, it's not how we think it is at all. Like I was saying earlier about phosphates in food. Yeah. Phosphates in food is what gives, is what gives, gives them the energy. But they're also in a vicious cycle because they're losing energy because of all the other compounds that are, are within the, the, the food elements that are actually being eaten. Yeah. So what, I'm, what, what actually happens is you are then able, you are then able to push more, more oxygen and more light to the tissues and throughout your system through the phosphorus because the phosphorus is directly connected to the oxygen, which means that the phosphorus is then connected to our breathing. Yeah, it's connected to our it's connected to our breathing, right? Um, it's connected to our breathing, uh, and because of, because of that, so you, you if if you're going to get high, remember earlier I was saying about hypo, hypo, right? Now hypo means under, so you can get something called hyperphosphatemia, which is hypo, which is under, under phosphate, emia means blood, right, so you can have under amount of phosphorus, phosphate, in your blood, but remember, all things work on, on, on levels, yeah, all things work on levels, different levels of energy, so, so where, where we may feel, like people walk around and they think, oh, I'm not sick, because my physical body's okay, and I'm not in the hospital, and I'm not in a hospital bed, but you can still be sick because there is a much subtle elemental work into the reality you're experiencing. So where you think it is only black and white, there's still another seven colours in between that. Yeah. So therefore, when we think, when we think, yeah, that, oh, I'm OK and everything's well, I'm eating these foods and I'm not just eating these foods. I'm doing all these, all, all, the, all these things that are truly harmful, really, that are truly harmful, really. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but you 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 are still okay. You feel like you you do all sorts. You might you work in a um you, you work these 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 jobs where you have to work at night 
and so on and so forth. So you have to work at night now, so you, you, you eat at night. Now what happens is, then because you're doing, because you are outside of what you should be doing also, there we, that redshift pulling action, fire of Prometheus, you know, work, etc., pulls you, pulls you to go for the, 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 the things of, that align with that red portion of that transverse pulling action. So now it's telling you to go for Red Bull, chocolate, I'm tired. This, this is what, how it works. That's how they've done this to, to the people. And then most things contain caffeine, right? Diuretics that remove the phosphate, which we're going to go into, which we're going to go into. Right. So, right. So, so that is, so, so then what happens is when you, with, when, when somebody has the phosphate, phosphatemia, yeah, right, it, it, it means that they are suffering with breathing problems. So if you don't have the correct level of phosphate, if you don't have the, 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 the correct level of phosphate, then what then what will actually happen? What actually happens to you? Yeah, uh, is, is that it's it, one of the things that it does is it affects your breathing. Yeah, low levels of phosphate. Uh, if you are lacking in vitamin D, yeah, which we need to, you can't absorb the phosphate without the vitamin D. So, for example, one of the things that I one of the things that I have that I've written that I've written here, which I will share. I will share and I'll just read it out now because remember what I'm always doing is like I've always every, every things just keep coming to me. I tell you, right? What, what actually happened was what actually happened was is this, 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 this. Once I started accessing these superior states of energy through the blood, through through working with the soul essence in the blood, yeah, right. Then what happened was my 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 brain capacity started increasing drastically and things started just rapidly coming to me constantly, yeah. That and that and that and now I know that they are scared of you accessing superior states of energy. They are scared of your energy compounding, and that is why I keep teaching it. So it says here, we need phosphorus and bicarb to regulate the breathing. Right? We need vitamin D to synthesize phosphorus. Yeah, but we need. But you see, this is it, right? But we need. But we need bile from the alkaline from the alkaline consumption. In our client internal environment, yeah, to, we create the bile to synthesize the vitamin D. Yeah, that's one of the, that's one of them there, right? See, so there, there, you can, you, we, we, we see how, how that, how that, how that plays out. So then, what I was, what I was saying is, 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 is that I'm, I go for, once I have drunk this, this age during, drunk the age during, yeah. I'm then going to apply it to the skin, to the meridians, to the meridians, because then it's all of that, this reabsorption, any reabsorption, you see, your field, which I'm going to go into on the next one, yeah, I'm going to get the big board out, I'm on big board and do it that way, right, the, it, it's a divergence, a disassociate, which is DIs, which is spirit and matter, right, well, we'll go into that uh, on the next one, disassociation, Disassociation, yeah, takes place, yeah, when your when your body is trying to create a balance with your with your bicarbonate buffer system, yeah. Disassociation, disasso, which is this, which is this here, which um, which I'll go into. Now, what what happens then is is is, is that you've created an internal energy, an internal energy, yeah. That when you that is pushing you, that is why you are that you see the oxygen now is now being increased because you see this molecule here, the gym, the, this tetrahedron, this tetrahedron here is in here, but if this tetrahedron that is the same as this methane, methane fuel, which is a supercharged energy, supercharged energy, which is commanded by carbon. Carbon, yeah, the light. Now, when you when you can when you are working with this, working with this, yeah, then what is what is actually happening? What is actually happening? You are unlocking levels, unlocking, unlocking levels of energy, constantly, all of the time, right? That is how it works. Then what happens then is I employ this brahartin, yeah, brahartin, right. Why do I why do I call it why do I call it um, brahatin? 
The reason, the reason I call it Brahatin, right, you just bear me up, because I'm going to go right back to my tarot, right, at the same time here, because I want to go to a particular, uh, particular card, right, which is going to be this one here. I'm looking at this, see, this is the Gimel, which is three, the Empress. I spoke about this a lot. In, as languages alters and change, it comes through, right? The, in the, the Hebrew language and the Greek language, you see the three and the seven is interchangeable. The interchangeable, right? And we're going to go through that. I'm going to be mentioning that. I mentioned that for good reason here. But so you 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 have this um, this bicarbonate buffer system that goes. What it does is it goes from the CO two here and CO two plus water. Yeah. So what the, this this here is when you are ex, expending breath, pretty much. But and the CO two. CO2, yeah, is a direct, it's like a thermometer, which is directly connected to the pH of your blood. Now, speaking about, I've been having like, you know, debates and so on and so forth about alkalinity for years, long, 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 long time. And then what happened was, we started, we, 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 there's, there's a few things, there's a calcium, calcium area, right? But there's the, the other in the bones and the other, the other area is, is the, the alkaline, the, the difference between alkalinity of the blood and alkalinity of the cells. And it's just like when you, when you, um, understand the, the, the conspiracy workings of the science side of, um, the body in terms of alkalinity, etc., and the electricity and so on and so forth, it was the same as the flat earth and the urine therapy. People were saying, would say to me in 2000 and say like 14 and whatever it was, they, they would say, well, hang on a minute, no, that, that's wrong, because it's your, the pH of your blood doesn't change, blah, 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 blah. Well, actually, it's, it's a bit wrong. That just doesn't work like that. I'll tell you why. The, the reason is, 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 is this. The pH of your blood stays between 7.34, whatever it is, to 7.459. Right. Now, any slight, in, any slight altering of that affects the enzymes you see the enzymes are biological molecules and that is called it's carbonase it's a carbonase and that it's it's in here it's in here right now enzymes are biological molecules biological mo mo molecules typically proteins that sig significantly speed up the rate of virtually all of the chemical reactions that take place within the cell they are vital for life and serve a wide range of important functions in the body. pH alteration affects the working of the enzymes. Yeah, right? And so you need proteins to be carried by your, like your tRNA. It's a, it will carry a protein, right? And in order so that it can be synthesized, all this synthesizing and the proteins can be take, take, take place via your organic code, which resides within the DNA of your cell. Right. So this, the, it is affected by this. So what happens is when I have done, done all of this, I'm clearing. See, when you work on a metaphysical level, what happens is a dentist they they like lifespan is a bit shorter because they are breathing when people breathe on people breathe on you yeah they are breathing their 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 toxic waste on they're breathing their negative emotion on you co2 yeah this is works in a matter remember see this is what I'm, i was saying about matter state yeah matter state as it comes up you see bicarbonate as it comes what, what bicarbonate what happens is is is, is this we're going to run a test in a minute right with the with it, with these, with these here. See, bicarbonate does some fantastic things. When your cell generates energy, it kicks off like an exhaust bicarbonic carbonic acid, right? Which is around here. This is this carbonic acid here. Yeah, this carbonic acid mixes with this with this hydrogen. That then becomes hydrogen car hydrogen carbonate. Yeah, hydrogen carbonate. Then you see we have a H here, which is a hydrogen. Right. So and then you have H3O3, which is bicarb. Now, what actually happens is when you don't the CO2 is connected directly to your pH. So when you are inhaling more, the more inhaling that you do, the more CO2 that you are bringing in. 
but you are putting it on top of your negative emotion. You're putting it on top of the negative emotional state that we are that we are hiding, that we don't know about, that we are ignoring. Because Bim Tati, people come to other people and they use their voice box seven. They use their voice box seven, yeah, to project um, negative.